one of the buildings we wanted to build was something that reflects more the modern German architecture and modern German lifestyle. And so um, out of that came an interest because of the cultural uh, focus in Germany on environmental things, just being outdoors uh, and in, you know, over time also the Green Movement and the Green Party and from that then more and more uh, development on sustainable architecture, design, mechanical systems, uh, alternative energy, renewable energy uh, systems and all that. So we wanted to bring that all together as much as possible with the primary purpose of um, creating something that's an educational building. Uh, so we're calling it an environmental living center uh, because people live here, the villagers who, uh, who come to Valsi live here as well. But it's a very hands-on kind of uh, place where you can do lots of different activities that all relate to environmental education or to, um, or to uh, uh, alternative energy issues. So, so that's for the, the idea of what we wanted to build. What we've basically done is we've built a big cooler, right? Like a big igloo cooler and it's got a bottom and it's got a top and it's got four sides. And when you put something inside it that's hot, it's going to stay hot. And when you put a cold thing inside it, it's going to stay cold. And so we do that by making really thick floors and really thick ceilings and really thick walls. And there's a bunch of different ways that we do that. And then we seal it up so tight that no air can get in and no air can get out. The Passive House Standard actually started in Germany and uh, it really focuses on reducing energy consumption and which then leads to more sustainable uh, way of living. And it, it fo it, uh, the emphasis is on reducing energy consumption by 85%. That's how you meet the standard. There's two stages to meeting the standard or getting certified, which, and this is the very first certified passive house in the U.S. All the parts of the technology and how it looks and feels in here, all the sunlight, you know, people really respond to this whole environment. Part of it's the modern look of it and part of it is just the fact that, you know, this is a structure that is so energy efficient and yet it's so comfortable to be in. Um, we have a lot of people from within the community, adults especially, that, that come in and see it just to see what it looks like and to find out how it was built. And then they're going back to their contractors or their architects and asking, you know, how can I get this, this is what I want. And then we have people come in and show their architects, you know, this is what I want, or their, their contractors.